just a welcome again to Ma'am Rajna. Again, um, the main purpose of calling you here was also uh, to maybe highlight a bit more on what we all are doing. And again, as she's already pointed out very rightly, that um, we are not only looking at 99 percenters. We are looking at children with a wholesome personality where they go out and they win the world. And I think that is what Imad has done. So over to him. Any questions that you have, Kandy? First, probably Imad could yeah. give a brief. He joined us in grade 8 here. And he's grown over these years. And maybe now his journey, he, he would probably like to share with you himself. Before I speak about my eventful journey in Auckland, I wish to extend my heartiest gratitude to each and everyone here associated with press and media. It's one of the things that I have always felt is that media plays a great role in each and everything that happens in our country. And also, I believe that media plays a great role in expressing the level of intelligence and competency in our country. A nation at largely, I can say, is also run by media. During last seven days, I attended one of the most prestigious, the World Leadership Congress at Auckland in New Zealand. With around 1,800 delegates from 60 countries of the world, this conference primarily focused at discussing different aspects of global political economy. The conference also focused on the scope of renewable energy and sustainable development of different countries like Africa. In my address, I acknowledged the relations between India and Africa. My discussion laid greater emphasis on how the father of our nation, Mahatma Gandhi, developed his political philosophy, concepts of non-violence and peaceful resistance in Africa. All the experiences, memories and friendships that I have earned at different international levels, international forums and platforms have largely been because of Manavishna International School. I would like to quote an American philanthropist and a statesman here. He said, if you can dream, you can even achieve it. So if my actions and performances have inspired others to dream more, learn more and become more, I can say that I have done my performance, I consider my performance well done. One of the things which I would like to share with you all is that I firmly believe that India is having a lot of talent. We have a great history and experience in terms of social, economic and political eras. Unfortunately, most of the students don't get opportunities like what I have received in these three years at Manavishna International School. So a message that goes from my side is that we should encourage students to explore the world. Since I have traveled to some of the most developed countries of the world like Dubai, Germany and now New Zealand, I have also realized that the state of development depends upon the control of population. Their basic planning structures and policies are very appropriate and that is where we need to learn from them and work upon for the same. I believe that there is no shame in doing this. I would also like to state that Manavishna International School has given me a lot of support and guidance in all terms. The entire staff of Manavishna International School Sector 46 has taught me some of the great things and uh, they have given me a lot of support and guidance in all terms under the chairmanship of our uh, Honorable Chairman and Chancellor Manavishna University. Dr. O.P. Bala, sir. I have continuously said this and today I repeat that schools must encourage children. Believe me, there is a lot of peer pressure in today's world, especially in India. It is very important for students to attain more practical knowledge rather than becoming bookworms. My parents have played an extraordinary role in my life. While it is true that uh, you have to work upon after your hard work, but what is true is that you need support. Without support, you can't do anything in your life. And that is what they have given me, Mana Vishnu International School Sector for this Gurga. Our last session ka jo subject tha, wo renewable energy and sustainable development. Tha. To us doran, mene India or Africa ke jitne relations rahe, us pe focus kiya. Kuch aise delegates ke jinhone object kiya tha ki India or Africa kaise collaborate kare. लेकिन मैंने जो हिस्ट्री है महात्मा गांधी की अगर आप देखें तो उन्हें अपनी पॉलिटिकल स्ट्रगल जो है 
अफ्रीका से ही स्टार्ट हो गई तो मैंने उस पे जो है ज़्यादा फोकस दिया और मैंने हाईलाइट किया कि इस तरह महात्मा गांधी ने जो है अपनी पोलिटिकल फिलासफी और स्ट्रगल जो है शुरू की और मुझे लगता है वही एक अच्छा पॉइंट था मानव रचना में जब मैंने ज्वाइन किया टू थाउजेंड एट में तो कुछ नई अपॉर्चुनिटीज़ आई मैम का सपोर्ट रहा प्रिंसिपल मैम का सपोर्ट रहा एग्जीक्यूटिव डायरेक्टर साहब का सपोर्ट रहा चेयरमैन सर का सपोर्ट तो ये जो सपोर्ट जो है डिग्नेटरी से जो मुझे मिला है यूनिवर्सिटी से स्कूल से जो भी मैनेजमेंट है मानव रचना इंटरनेशनल की मैनेजमेंट स्टाफ स्टूडेंट्स पेरेंट्स इन सब चीज़ों ने जो है मुझे काफ़ी इनक्रेज किया और हाँ मानव रचना में ही ऐसी अपॉर्चुनिटीज़ मुझे मिली कि मैं आगे अपने आप को जो है फ्यूचर में आप क्या देखते हैं फ्यूचर में मैं आई एस की तैयारी करना चाहूँगा मैं इंडियन एडमिनिस्ट्रेटिव सर्विस एग्जाम्स में अपेयर हूँ और मेरा बस यही एम है कि मैं पॉजिटिविटी सोसाइटी में लाऊँ और जो बेसिक एम एंड जो हमारा लोगों जो हमारा मोटो है मानव रचना में दैट इज़ क्रिएटिंग बेटर ह्यूमन बींग्स तो दैट्स वॉट आई नीड वो ही जी थैंक यू